Hello everyone, so this book review is on Thomas Page McBee's Man Alive and it is a very tender heartfelt memoir as Thomas says, a true story of violence, forgiveness and becoming a man. For Thomas is a transgender man and in this memoir, it's short, it's only 140 pages, Thomas uh, recounts uh, some dark experiences of his childhood where he, where he was sexually abused, the effect that this had on his relationship, an increasingly estranged relationship with his mother, how that affected his growing up, also then through two experiences as an adult where he feels that being in a female body actually protected him from violence and so he recounts and confronts these memories um, and his experiences as he begins the early stages of hormone treatment um, and the effects that has on his body and his current relationships so huge amount of subjects fascinating subjects and, and incredibly important themes in this book and so this is where we come on to my first challenge with this book because it is only 140 pages and there is so much here that i wanted to enjoy and examine on masculinity on forgiveness on healing on violence on male violence uh, there was so much here that you wanted to really spend time on and thomas is such a good writer his He's actually a columnist as well and his his writing is incredibly engaging and touching and bittersweet but we i felt we only skimmed the surface uh here uh, what i would have given for this to be twice the length and then this got me thinking well am i placing too much on this book is it unfair for me to because we don't have very many memoirs from transgender men so therefore when one comes through like this you sort of <gasps> and you want to pin everything onto it which is perhaps unfair and I guess this also comes on to my next point because we all have all have the right to say our stories and share our experiences as they are but because this book is so slim and because obviously transgenderism is for reasons I don't understand a subject of much contention and debate and hostility in society there is the real possibility that people could read this people who are bigoted and discriminatory and say aha violence in childhood ipso facto you want to become a man later in life because your female body your experiences as a girl were so traumatic and of course those two aren't linked and i just felt there was an inference by being for this book being so slim and that you could link the two if you wanted to and that that struck me as a real shame um however this book is beautiful it is beautifully written and like i said it's only 140 pages so you just skim through it in a couple of hours uh it's such a shame it wasn't a bit longer, but a beautiful memoir, Man Alive by Thomas Page McBee.